and his court translators. Hey, good morning, friends. Um, what I'm doing now is removing, believed that this finishing was removing the, the, since the manuscripts of bracing and bar and system they from the 68 Camaro, which is on the lift. This was all part of the rotisserie, which is sitting on the ground over here. Philosophy. And I'm storing it away, putting it away, light. but I'm just wanted to show you to that this bracket system that I made when I hung this car in the rotisserie about a year ago, maybe a year and four months ago or so, has served its purpose very well. Um, Latin was still the language. What I do is I make the rotisserie fit the car. I don't do it the other way around. That way it keeps the car's integrity very good. From ancient um, Greek it doesn't into Renaissance upset Europe, this that Latin. much. Now, There's a couple small the areas on the bottom that I have to address and clean and fix. Idea um, old weld marks that I have to remove. In from the these bar past, systems that are here, Judaism, but that's in place. And I just want you to hear this. This primeval theology, this pristine early theology from which everything else grew, from which everything else sprang. This is a lecture about Hermes Trismegistus by a guy named Michael. Just that. God, I can't it remember his name. Time capsule it's just something new and random Egypt, I put on. Egyptian it's kind of cool. Philosophy that predated everything else. It was a primary theology. And these manuscripts... Mitch Horowitz. Became huge. Mitch Horowitz is this guy's name that's talking. Across the world Let me tell you what. I get so tired... Of Ozzy's Boneyard every day, and I'll describe the same music the every day on all the channels. I gave up on Howard Stern a long time ago. Um, that is the contemporary Howard Stern. I listen to the old stuff at night with Eric the Midget and Jeff the Drunk, you know, those old funny guys. But the new stuff I can't listen to. It's insulting. One thing I That's learned about this good. lecture this that I'm great. listening to right it's now is that um, Sherman Hemsley, actor that was in uh, was The Latin. Jeffersons, and the he played the racist black guy back in the 70s um, after the Archie Bunker it. show with Carol Connor playing the racist white guy. The you don't know about this, Sherman uh, Hemsley uh, was a big Kabbalist. He read the Kabbalion all the time, and when he was interviewed by some, you know, Hollywood douchebag type, uh, why don't you go out to all these parties and stuff, he said, because they're all boring. The only interest is in the mind. Things that go on in the mind is what appealed to him, which just really resonates with me, because the music shit... I can't listen to it. The same old shit over and over again. I need new things. I need new challenges, new music, new ideas to grow. I can't stay still. I can't stay stoic in my old past, old music. I just can't do it. I won't do it. So anyways, here it is. Uh, and I looked a little bit too heavy. I'm going to have to lose weight again. A real um, that means not going out to lunch with my buddy Mike all the time because he can put away some food and uh, so I'm gonna I'm gonna you know take off 20 pounds like I did last year so <laughs> back to work choose have a good day